Managing blood sugar levels effectively is crucial for individuals with diabetes. One key metric that doctors use to monitor long-term blood sugar control is HbA1c. This reflects the average blood glucose levels over the past two to three months. Lowering HbA1c levels can significantly reduce the risk of diabetes-related complications. While there are various methods to manage and reduce HbA1c, recent studies and experts highlight an approach that might just be the fastest way to achieve this goal. But before we continue, if you appreciate all the information and the research that goes into making a video like this, it does help out tremendously if you hit the like button and hit subscribe. Thank you, and let's begin. A promising method that has shown remarkable results in lowering HbA1c levels is intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting involves cycling between periods of eating and fasting. It's not just a diet, but a pattern of eating that has been found to improve insulin sensitivity and reduce blood sugar levels. Studies suggest that intermittent fasting can help lower HbA1c faster than many traditional methods. One study published in the journal Cell Metabolism explored the effects of intermittent fasting on type 2 diabetes patients. The participants followed a fasting schedule that restricted their eating to an 8-hour window each day. After 12 weeks, the results were impressive. The participants saw a significant reduction in their HbA1c levels, some by as much as 1.5% to 2%. This reduction is notable because even a 1% drop in HbA1c can reduce the risk of diabetes-related complications like heart disease, kidney disease, and neuropathy by a substantial margin. Intermittent fasting works by giving the body a break from constant insulin production. When we eat, our bodies produce insulin to help manage the glucose from the food. Constant eating means constant insulin production, which can lead to insulin resistance over time. By fasting, the body has periods where it doesn't need to produce insulin, which can help improve insulin sensitivity and lower blood glucose levels. Another aspect of intermittent fasting that contributes to lower HbA1c levels is weight loss. Many people who follow intermittent fasting schedules tend to lose weight, which is directly linked to improved insulin sensitivity. A study in the Lancet Diabetes and Endocrinology showed that weight loss from intermittent fasting was more effective in reducing HbA1c levels compared to other calorie restriction diets. Participants in the study not only lost weight, but also saw significant improvements in their blood sugar control. It's not just about when you eat, but also what you eat. Combining intermittent fasting with a low-carbohydrate diet can enhance the benefits even further. Low-carb diets reduce the intake of foods that spike blood sugar levels, which means the body needs to produce less insulin. This combination has been shown to be highly effective in several studies. For instance, a study from the European Journal of Clinical Nutrition found that participants who followed both a low-carb diet and an intermittent fasting schedule experienced a more significant drop in HbA1c levels compared to those who followed only one of these approaches. Exercise also plays a crucial role in managing HbA1c levels. Regular physical activity helps muscles use glucose more effectively, reducing blood sugar levels. Combining intermittent fasting with regular exercise can accelerate the reduction in HbA1c levels. A study in the Journal of Diabetes Research highlighted that participants who combined intermittent fasting with resistance training experienced a significant drop in their HbA1c levels. The combination of fasting periods with exercise sessions seemed to maximize the body's ability to manage blood sugar effectively. It's fascinating to see how these strategies work synergistically. Intermittent fasting helps the body reset its insulin sensitivity, weight loss reduces the demand on insulin, and exercise improves glucose uptake by muscles. This multifaceted approach creates an environment where HbA1c levels can drop quickly and sustainably.
While the scientific evidence supporting intermittent fasting is robust, it's essential to approach it safely. Starting with shorter fasting periods and gradually increasing the duration can help the body adjust without feeling deprived or fatigued. It's also crucial to maintain a balanced diet, rich in nutrients during the eating periods. Consuming whole foods, lean proteins, healthy fats, and plenty of vegetables ensures that the body gets all the necessary nutrients while managing blood sugar levels. It's worth mentioning that intermittent fasting might not be suitable for everyone. Individuals with certain medical conditions, pregnant women, or those with a history of eating disorders should consult with a healthcare provider before starting any fasting regimen. Personalized medical advice is always recommended to ensure that any new dietary approach is safe and effective for an individual's specific health needs. The journey to lower HbA1c levels is a marathon, not a sprint. While intermittent fasting shows promise in delivering fast results, consistency is key. Adopting a lifestyle that includes regular fasting periods, a healthy diet, and regular exercise can sustain these benefits long term. The initial drop in HbA1c levels can be significant, but maintaining these levels requires ongoing commitment and lifestyle adjustments. Imagine the benefits of a lifestyle where intermittent fasting is a regular practice. Not only can it lower HbA1c levels rapidly, but it can also improve overall health, reduce the risk of chronic diseases, and enhance well-being. The science behind it is compelling, and the results from various studies provide a strong foundation for its efficacy. The excitement doesn't stop here. As more research unfolds, we continue to learn how to optimize fasting schedules, dietary choices, and exercise routines to maximize health benefits. This approach, though powerful, is just one piece of the puzzle in diabetes management. It's a holistic journey that encompasses various lifestyle changes, and intermittent fasting can be a catalyst for achieving remarkable health outcomes. The world of diabetes management is evolving, and with it, our understanding of how to effectively lower HbA1c levels. Intermittent fasting, with its profound impact on insulin sensitivity and blood sugar control, stands out as a potent strategy. For those seeking to lower their HbA1c levels quickly and sustainably, exploring intermittent fasting might just be the game-changer they need. The journey might require patience and perseverance, but the potential rewards, a healthier, more vibrant life, are well worth the effort. Managing diabetes effectively involves taking steps to reduce HbA1c levels. Intermittent fasting has shown promising results in achieving this goal quickly and sustainably. By cycling between periods of eating and fasting, the body can reset its insulin sensitivity and reduce blood sugar levels more effectively. Combined with a low-carb diet and regular exercise, intermittent fasting becomes a powerful tool for improving diabetes management. However, it's important to approach this method with care and seek personalized medical advice, especially for those with specific health conditions. Adopting intermittent fasting as part of a holistic lifestyle change can lead to significant improvements in HbA1c levels and overall well-being. Embracing this approach can bring about remarkable health benefits, paving the way for a healthier future for those managing diabetes.